Welcome, sir. Uh, good evening. Uh, Happy New Year. Um, my name is Damon Jones. Even though I am an employee of Westchester County Department of Corrections, I am not speaking on behalf of Westchester County Department of Corrections. I'm speaking on behalf of the New York Representative of Blacks and Law Enforcement of America, which is a national organization of black law enforcement professionals. Um, it was brought to our attention that one of the Westchester County Police Academies, and I'm going to refer to Westchester County Police Academy as WCPA, just to, to move quickly. Um, they had a police on police um, shooting training. And in that training, uh, they brought one of the officers that actually killed Detective Christopher Ridley to the class. Um, unfortunately for the cadets that were there, it wasn't, they did not feel it was an actual training exercise when the officer was berating uh, Detective Ridley. Now, let's understand. We, we, we all know what happened to Detective Ridley. And if all police officers involved did everything right, then Detective Ridley would be alive today. Um, the actions actually should shock everybody's conscience because any progressive policies to address the changes of the outcome of these incidents. New York State has a history of 27 incidents where black law enforcement officers off duty on plain clothes have been shot, shot and killed by their white counterparts. And this incident has never happened in the reverse in New York. So we understand that there is a need. On May 9, 2008, the Westchester County Public Safety issued recommendations in a review of the use of force training. Out of 17 recommendations of the use of force training, there is not one that advises any instructor to create ridicule an officer that lost his life due to, due to the actions of all parties involved. The 2008 recommendations also question the diversity of, of the Westchester County Police Academy in full-time instructors. So we want to ask what, what changes was made since 2008. It also recommended that Westchester County Tra Training Advisory Committee should be created outside the Westchester Chiefs Association panel. This committee should be made up of the uh, WCPA director of training and representatives from the community, community leaders, clergy, educators. Have they created this panel? And who are on the panel? In 2010, New York State Police on Police Task Force issued more recommendations. The key finding of their report that racial bias, conscious or unconscious, plays a role in officers' decision to shoot or not shoot a subject. What classes do the Westchester County Police Academy offer cadets or suggest this yearly refresher course to local police departments in racial awareness so trained officers can avoid stereotyping by dress or other features of personal appearance? Sure, if you could just kind of wrap up. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, yes, good. I have it in right. So um, this, this week is the anniversary of Christopher Ridley, and I think in his memory we should address this because Westchester County Police Academy trains all police officers in the 43 municipality, so we shouldn't have, have these type of mistakes. Thank you. Thank you, sir. And if you want, oh, great. Thank you.